Hello everyone, and welcome to Nightlife. I'm Jake Sterling. And I'm Christine Kelly. We bring you the news, tidbits and highlights you just can't get on normal news or Facebook feeds. So sit back and relax, and join us for the ultimate in nightlife. Today's top story is about an absolutely fantastic saxophone player, Bill Bergman. I'm telling you Christine, he is the most talented sax player I've seen in a long long time. He is so hot, you can actually see the lava ooze out of the bell of his tenor saxophone. Incredible I tell you. He sounds too good to be true. Wow. No kidding, he can seriously blow the horn. In his own words. Big fat tenor sax sound. He's known all over the world as the saxophone player in Jack Mack and a Heart Attack, as well as a long-time Ellie Studio musician with an extremely long list of credits to his name. He's released several great albums, the most current one is called Universe Soul, but I hear he is currently working on a new project these days, Christine. Oh, that is absolutely fascinating, Jake. We need to get the latest scoop on what the Berg is working on now. Heavens, I love to hear a funky jazz sax player going off big time. So do I. And right you are. This is a man with chops of steel and killer riffs. Just like blowing the carbon right out of an engine. Good grief Christine. Where do you come up with those ingenious descriptions? I never would have thought of it that way. Telling it like it is Jake, telling it like it is. You know Christine, I've heard the man once say, whatever I got to give, comes out of that horn. Good grief, I got goosebumps just contemplating on it. Uh, where is that, dawn glass of water when I need it? Well we're running out of time. That wraps up yet another issue of nightlife. Say goodbye Jake. Ha ha. Gotcha Virgie. I think we're off the air now. Thank God. Now where is that dawn glass of water? My throat feels like gravel. Oh, stop your whining Jake, you such a wuss. Why can't you just do one show straight through without complaining about something? What? You think I'm a problem here? Let me tell you something Christine. If it weren't for me, you would be back on Wheel of Bloody Fortune looking like a dumb bimbo and turning letter blocks for the rest of your life. You pompous ignorant chauvinist pig. How dare you say that to me? I'll have you know I'll have your hairy hide fired for sexual abuse. How do you like that one? Oh, go stuff it Chrissy. You stuff it you old goat. You two-timing wench. You anchor. Twit. Jerk. Pain in the neck. Shut up, you stiff English bore. And, you out there, turn off that stupid camera. Turn it off now, this instant. Man, I don't get paid enough to go through this every night. Maybe I can go back to Sheffield and get my old job back at the meatpacking plant. I quit. Good riddance. We need some bloody fresh blood around here anyway. No one could pay me enough to put up with the likes of you every night. I said to turn off that camera. Turn it off I say.